of the revamping of the Tampa International Airport, travelers can purchase food with the Bay Area flair. Now, many local restaurants and bars will have a presence at TIA, but there's one that has more than profit behind its business model. Get on your side's Josh Thomas has more on that story. Metropolitan Ministries is probably best known for feeding the needy during Thanksgiving in the holiday season, but it's also feeding those who are not so needy. Travelers going through Tampa International Airport can purchase food prepared by students at Metro's Culinary Arts School, students who've gone through hard times like Josh Keene. My whole family, they, they, they're really proud of me and they see the changes I've made in my life and uh, they're really proud of me. Keene is one of dozens of students who are learning life skills that will allow them to be self-sufficient. I really enjoy what I'm doing now and I'm looking forward to moving on with my life. Metro Ministries started in the box four years ago as a catering business. They now have two cafes in Tampa and a presence at TIA. Oh, I think it's a great milestone for us to reach because how many people are going through the airport every single day? They're going to see our brand standard and my picture on the side of the refrigerator there and we're selling our product there. And Each meal comes with a pamphlet explaining the ministry's mission. And the part that I like about it is it's going to show the visitor that the care that Tampa Bay community has for those who are hurting and hungry and homeless. Uh, so it's just a great way to get that message out. All the prepared food is purchased fresh from local vendors at a discount with the proceeds going right back to Metro Ministries. While Metropolitan Ministries Inside the Box program plans to branch out, it's most proud of the impact it's had on those who prepare the food. In Tampa, Josh Thomas, News Channel 8.